Hello everyone, my name is Alex. Today we're gonna replace a, a patio sliding door. This is the one I bought from uh, Home Depot. It's an unassemble, unassembled frame. I put it together myself. Basically just, uh, you know, four pieces. One, two, three, four. Screw, screw them together. And today we're gonna replace this uh, patio uh, French doors. I think they're like 40 years old. If you come, if you look from the inside, you know they have cracks and the, the it's got air leak. Anyway, we're gonna replace them with this, and uh, it's a simple process. Couple things: you gotta remove the trim from the outside. Remove this one. Three pieces on the outside and uh, three trims on the inside. And then after that you have the door frame. You just gotta I use this this tool. I don't know what it's called. You guys know what it's called. I use this one uh, and a hammer. Pull it out. And uh, anyway, I'll show you what I'm gonna be doing. Simple process. Enjoy it. This is how the door, the French door looks on the inside. I removed the trim. And this is the door frame. So next step is to uh, remove those, unscrew those doors, take them out, and then we can. I, I'm gonna go ahead and remove the frame. It's uh, four pieces: one, two, three, and one on the bottom right there. And uh, I'm installing this this door right here, Anderson, American Craftsman by Anderson. So I just removed the two doors and uh, well, all I got left is the frame, door frame to remove. So that's how it looks, that's the frame, it's coming out. This one's got two pieces over here. It's got basically two pieces, this one, this part and this part, they're two separate ones. This one is nailed into this one. So. Anyway, let's take it out. So here's the uh, door opening without the door frame. Next step is to measure the door opening. And uh, this house was built in uh, 1973, so I guess the standards were a little bit different. This one is uh, wider and taller, and uh, I'm gonna have to adjust it. I'm gonna put uh, two 2x4s two on the sides, and one on each side and uh, two on top, because the 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 top is a little bit taller, seven, uh, 85 inches, no, 83 inches almost. And this one is uh, uh, 83, 80 inches by 72. Yeah, 80 by 72. Anyway, so I'm gonna screw this uh, two by fours, two on the side, one on each side and two on top. So after you have installed the 2x4s, what I'm gonna do next is uh, apply this flashing on the bottom and uh, 2 inches up on the bottom and uh, right here, 2 inches up here. So let's do this. So after I applied some, put some flashing on the bottom of the, on the base of the frame, you can, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, install the put the frame door frame inside and secure it with uh, those these screws right here uh, this frame it's it's got three drilled holes one two so four on, on each side and uh, i believe four on top so we apply i applied the the flashing and also if you, you can see i put uh, caulking two beads of caulking two inches up on each side and also the caulking goes on the on the flanges and the, so this flanges this caulking is gonna go against this uh, two by four so on the sides and on top too for a good seal so no insect can get through